645, your voice, your vote this morning. Governor Hickenlooper is going to be speaking at the Democratic National Convention today. Uh, Hickenlooper, of course, spoke once before at the convention. There's an old video there of him as mayor back when the DNC was here in Denver. Of course, that was in 2008. Governor Hickenlooper joins us live this morning out of uh, Charlotte. Well, don't, no, you don't have to cover up. You look, you look fine there, sir. Don't worry about it. <laughs> hey, how does tonight's speech differ from the one you gave four years ago? Well, uh, if in one case it's twice as long, it's actually six minutes, which is still not very long, but long enough to get yourself in trouble. But more importantly, back then we were the host uh, of the DNC, and so I hadn't slept in about two weeks, so it's all a blur back then. Now, I, I had a good night's sleep last night. Much nicer to be the guest. Yeah, there, absolutely. Uh, this race is very, very close. We all know that. What can you do or say tonight to convince people who are trying to figure out which of these candidates can revive the American dream. What can you say to folks out there that'll make them think, yep, the president's the person we should go with? Well, I want to talk from the point of view of a small business owner, you know, and, and someone who got, you know, I got laid off as a geologist back in 1986. And like a lot of people today, I was out of, out of work for, for two years. And, and then we build our business. And I think that perspective has real value today. And, you know, when you look at where we were in January of 2009 when the president took office and we were sliding down a, a, a cliff, really. Uh, you ask any honest CEO, any small business owner, they were losing revenues, they were losing customers. Uh, and now we're, we're arguing about is the, re is the recovery fast enough? I mean, our exports in the last two years are up almost 40 percent. In Colorado, our agricultural exports are up almost 60 percent. Uh, things have really turned around in a way that Again, back then, I think most people would have said, wow, that, that would be a miracle if we could get to there in, in, in three years, three and a half years. Yeah. All right. Governor Hickenlooper, thank you for joining us so uh, early this morning, and good luck uh, in your speech tonight. <laughs> I got an extra 20 if you say something oh. good about the Broncos and the Rockies, if you slip that in. <laughs> I'm on it. Okay. Very good. <laughs> thank you for joining us, sir. Good luck tonight.